All right, Rody. so today is the day. The cats are... Girls! Jeez. Anyway, um, so I just got done running some air. Ladies, that quit it, quit. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so I just got done running some errands, y'all. Today is the day. It's Renaissance Day again. I'm so excited. Me and Alex are going to go catch the 10 p.m. showing um, out in Dallas at the IMAX Theater. Jesus, I can't. Amex, IMAX, Lord Jesus. But um, we're going to go see it at an IMAX Theater in Dallas. And I'm just really excited, y'all. Uh, but something weird has been going on because... As I've been like running my errands today, I kept hearing this noise and it's real unique. Unique? That's what you are. So yeah, I, I don't know what that is, but anyway, um, I'm about to hop in the shower and then go get my hair cut, come back here, get ready, got a doctor's appointment, and then I'm gonna meet up with Alex, we're gonna have dinner, and then we're gonna go see the show. So y'all get ready to strap in tight, buckle up, cause we're about to go on a road trip, y'all. You Nick? That's what you are. All right, Rody. so I am on the road right now, running a little late, okay? <laughs> but I'm on the way to a doctor's appointment, and then um, from there, I'm gonna go meet up with Alex. We're gonna go eat, and then from there, we're going to the show. Um, I, oh, oh, by the way, here's my, my fit. You know, I got the Alien Superstar shirt. Ooh, <laughs> the Alien Superstar shirt with um, the vlog knob varsity um i still have been hearing something real unique y'all and it's real weird i was sitting in the barber's chair and i heard it and i'm like i had to look at my barber like jacob you hear that unique that's what you are so yeah i i don't know what that is but hopefully we figure that out soon because i'm bugging okay <laughs> but I'm super excited, y'all. I'm so excited. It's been a long day, a lot of stuff going on, but we should get there soon. Um, and I can't wait to show y'all the experience. I don't know what I'm expecting. I think I want for it to be a joyous occasion. I think everybody's gonna be in great spirits. I personally don't mind if the people are up, dancing, doing what they wanna do, having a good time. You know, as long as you're not literally in my way, <laughs> then we're good. But I'm excited. I'm really excited. So uh, we'll talk a little bit more. Uh, I need to focus on road right now. Okay, y'all. Unique. That's what you are. What's up, Rodies? So y'all know Lex, okay? Now, as y'all saw in the, the vlog, nah, vlog, Shahila, well, I guess y'all didn't really see it, but Shahila gave us her wedding invitation. So live, I'm now presenting Alexis with hers. Now I kept this, cause I be, I be sandwiching it, cause I don't want it to get messed up. And I just, here, I'm gonna give you all, all of them. <laughs> It is. Okay, and now I see a big glow. That's what, because Eileen was like, is it like a light in it? It like glows on you. Is it the light? Yeah, the light. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. You are really need for that press guy to do something. Because I hate when, the, when it's too tight on the scores of the fantasy. And then I'm worried. It is. They got it. I think she said they had to like go through many really iterations of it. Okay. So, what are you looking forward to in the with the film? How you well, feeling? I uh, know I follow one of the dancers. What is her name? Gina something. Okay. Y'all know who I'm talking about. Okay. Um, I'm really excited to see her. Um, I'm 
Which one do you look like? Uh, she's like light skin. Ryan right moves. She's like right behind her. Yeah. Like short blonde wig. I'm gonna show you her. She has like her own dancing studio. Now, Alex's version of light skin might be different because she thinks she's a Nubian princess or queen. <laughs> Don't you see this skin? <laughs> see? Too much. I can't deal with her. Um, but anyway, okay. her. Okay. Um, I saw something. Um, she went to the, like, the actual premiere. Um, the one that just happened in LA? Yeah, she went to that one. And she said it was really good. Really? The okay. London one's happening tonight. The London right one is tonight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. She's there. Yeah. Yeah. Where you are a girl. Where you are a girl. Um, so is there, what is it that you want to see? All of it. Like, is it? <laughs> okay. <laughs> like, I, I, I want to see more of the technical aspects. Like, I want to find out about the horse that came out. Like, because we know, you know it's not... It was an actual horse. Aaron broke this down for me. Okay. It's an actual horse that they put out there during. Uh, 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 I know what you're talking about. You know, <laughs> what is it? What song? I, I know, but I said. The. Uh, what, what, what song? It's. I break my soul. Okay. It's during Break My Soul. Okay. I think it's gonna be. That's it's when it comes be something out. Something like her Netflix documentary where it's like all of the work behind it goes into it. I think so because I didn't do too much. I didn't. I tried not to watch too much. But they do say it's a lot more behind the scenes. But obviously with everything that she's putting in it, it's not going to be the whole performance. I know that she's doing the big three. The big three are automatically in it. Um, Good, because most of us didn't get it. Yeah. So we got to see it somehow. Lucky y'all. I think it, it walks us through Blue's experience. Okay. Because of, I heard, I think I'm, I'm right, but like... It was only supposed to. Do, she was only supposed to do one, one performance. Show. I did. I did hear that. Okay. And then she was really excited to do it. And she read the comments of what people were saying about her. Okay. And then she that is motivation to like better herself. So that's what her mom she wanted to do. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That I'm. I'm excited to see that. Um. Oh, my favorite part is Monique. Monique. That's what you are. Okay, anyway. Um, but my favorite, I really want to see movies. I really want to see, yeah. And I, I think what really excites me is like seeing, like, because we saw it in real time, but it's like, our eyes, it's not. You can only it's, focus on like one thing. Yes. And I want to see it all. Yes. yes. I want to see how she does it, where, what angle this looks like from there, and like how she wants us to see it. You know, because that's what it feels like. This film is very much how does Beyonce want us to see yes. Renaissance? Yes. You know? So I'm excited about that. I'm absolutely, absolutely excited. Um, yeah. We get to relive it. The Renaissance. <laughs> what? <laughs> I actually like what I like going to show. Oh yeah. Oh, 100. You need to do a what is it? A South America tour. It's not a world tour if you ain't going to the world. I need you to go to South America so we can go to Brazil. What about? <laughs> so, yeah. Oh right. I don't know if y'all heard about that. Well, I'm sure a lot of people heard about it. But like the Sphere in Vegas, like that, baby. Hey, top dollar. I wonder if it's gonna be a residency or just like maybe like a three night show. True. Do you think she's in the point where she's ready to? Do, I wonder. Is she ready to do a residency? Like she could if she I wanted like, to. I feel like she probably in talks of it. And it's like, well, no, okay. Somebody found that it says Renaissance at this. Whatever like came out that somebody found that and like did all that design. They went in and they took that part out. I think when it's the, the movie is act two. Act two? So there's supposed to be like four acts Right. So, so it's all encompassing Renaissance. Yes. So okay. I think the sphere could be another, another act. act. So. That it could. I could live that. Either way, we're going to the sphere. <laughs> we'll be at the sphere. I don't know how much that's going to cost. 
And I know that's gonna hurt my wallet. You know, debt paid off and everything, baby, but we'll be at the sphere. We'll be, <laughs> we'll be at the sphere, baby, ready, ready to go. So, are we about to go get some ice cream? So we're gonna get some ice cream, something to nibble on. My favorite, Jenny's splendid. Wait, Jenny. Jenny's, Jenny's, Jenny something. Jenny something. Um, we're gonna go eat that, and then we're gonna go. You gonna get some popcorn? She had her and Jay Z had their little bucket. I just ate. I'm about to eat some ice cream. I'm gonna go in there full. <laughs> now, how you feel about it? The people start dancing. As long as they don't get in the way. In the way, right? Like, you're, and I feel like we're going there to have a good time. I don't mm -hmm. care. Like, it's not like right. quiet. If, especially like if we were all there. Yeah. So I don't care about that. As long as like you don't get in the way. Yeah. Just don't be in my area of viewing. If you're not in the area of viewing, then we get to go. I feel like we'll be real good. Okay. So, all right, roadies, we're going to do all that. And then we will see y'all at the theater. Later. All right, roadies. So we have made it inside we're on our way people have already seen the film so oh there we go people have already seen the film so i thought we were doing good by getting right the 10 o'clock yeah the 10 o'clock premiere but as you can see everybody's dressed up the people have arrived um they've seen i feel i feel like they're not jumping for joy, the way that they should, that they should be jumping for joy. Um, but I know we're about to embark on it, so let's get it. Give it to him. Renna, 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 Oh, there's Renaissance merch. Oh. So, Rodies, we got per posters, little mini posters. Show them your poster. It's the same thing. Yeah. <laughs> um, they obviously have like popcorn buckets and things, and there's merch being sold here, but I have no idea where that mer that could even be. And maybe at the end. Uh oh. Here we go. Okay, so. I'm use the restroom, tink tink for a sec, and then we'll reconvene. And then where's the IMAX? Uh, it's, uh, just says IMAX is the to the left, like over there. Heard. Right, thank you. So it's made for IMAX. We wanted to see it the right way, the only way, the Renaissance way.
That was her? Uh, is she? I'm screaming. So we're freshly out of the Renaissance <laughs> film. What an experience, what an experience. I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna set up the camera, the tripod, everything. I'm gonna do a quick little review, uh, give y'all the justice y'all deserve. But I mean, an amazing film. How'd you feel? It was great. It was great. I relived my whole experience. Relived the whole experience, I new moments. Back. Yeah, yeah. I think you said she released a new song tonight. Yeah, she did. Baby. What? What? Yeah, it, Beyonce absolutely did that. That was an experience. That's how you make a, a, a film about your tour. It's great. Yeah. I, I, I think we heard new moments. We, the, the big three. Oh, yeah, 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 baby. <laughs> Beyonce. <laughs> You did that, girl. Hey, yeah, yeah. Take you took that money. money. Absolutely. Now, I, you know, I would have liked the feature. I think we deserved the feature in the film. Okay. You know, you know. We could have had a moment. We could have had a moment. We, uh, we had some moments. Know. Yeah. <laughs> but it was amazing, amazing, amazing. So I'm going to set up the tripod, give y'all a quick little, little powwow. And then, yeah, that's our experience. But uh, Renaissance, baby, if you didn't go, I'm sorry. But you can relive it. At the theater, I promise you, you'll get your life. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. Later. Okay. Roadies, roadies, roadies. Listen, okay. Let me, let me get it together, okay? I'm, I'm trying to give y'all true uh, Beyonce fashion right now. Behind the scenes. <laughs> Even though mother... Beyonce, she's she's giving uh, a quality right now. Right now, I'm giving you. Uh, it's not actually four. I never set my clock back after daylight savings, so it's actually three fifty-five. Um, but I'm fresh from the film. Is this? Cause I don't see the squigglies. I'm praying this is recording voice wise. But anyway, listen, y'all. I just got back from the film. What an experience. Uh, I, 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 she did what needed to be done. 
she absolutely did what needed to be done. I mean, it was an incredible experience. It was an incredible experience, y'all. I took some notes during it. I do want to say the title of this film should actually be Renaissance, a film by Beyonce all about gratitude. <laughs> It was nothing but gratitude. Like from all the notes that I have here, um, a lot of everything she had was about gratitude and how thankful she was for the production team, for uh, uh, time and like how she struggles with time. Right. And being able to uh, uh, live and not be a machine and not operate under time and hold on, let me turn this heat off um not operate under the the pressures of time but also still be in it and you gotta watch it you gotta watch it right um thanking her daughter and her children like thanking her mother her father her uncle johnny uh the queer community the queer folk just uh the lgbtqia plus folk like the women thinking it just <sighs> thanking houston who uh, thanking the experience with her voice when when she damaged it as a young girl uh and, and how it still allowed her to have an even richer voice uh uh, uh the beehive she thanked the beehive it was just a film on gratitude it was absolutely a film on gratitude and i love that i absolutely love that uh uh her thinking her age and coming into her own at 40 really being able to come into her own uh it was an experience i was up you know i was thinking like oh my god i know the people are gonna be turned up they're gonna be standing up dancing doing everything i was the people I was the one doing that. Uh, baby, baby. I was jumping up out of my seat, especially when Move came on. I was, oh, 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 bounce. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I was, baby. I, sorry, I have to. I didn't prep nothing. I didn't prep nothing. So this is raw. Um, but yeah, it was an incredible, incredible film, y'all. Like I say, um, everything that she talked about in this film um really enhanced it uh i do want to say hold on real quick real quick i do want to say right you know i was really was gonna do like a whole production video and everything y'all and i want you to see this because this i wrote this when i first did my top 10 moments countdown but y'all like I had everything ready. Production and set design. If you don't see this right here, like it was pages. And hold on, hold on. Is there another page? Turn the page, baby. Uh, before we got there, lighting props, baby. I'm glad that she gave that a moment. You know, I got a lot of names in here, a lot of a lot of moments, and I think that I really got to see it up close and personal um from the film i'm so grateful that she did that maybe i mean i just feel like other beehive members probably do it much more justice i have a lot of names of people and like really specifics on the people that helped bring it together um but i'm just so glad that she focused on that the lighting was a big thing that i'm glad she focused on as well um i just i do want to say that she loved dallas <laughs> sorry uh a, a lot of the the clips she was she was tapping into dallas she gave her all in dallas i knew it i knew it i i, I knew it i said what i said um uh, so that was amazing um oh at the beginning of the the film one of the beehive members got featured uh, uh she had her moment on the screen i think i had just turned my camera off um uh, but she was lit she was so live so check her out because i had to meet her at the end of the night just to to give her her moment and let her know like queen we saw you so check her out real quick so we've got a feature from the film baby what's your name my name is jessica jessica and which show did you attend i attended six six oh six i went to poland oh wow I went to st louis okay i went to both houston i went to dallas and i went to kansas city oh baby so you deserve the feature absolutely okay. well shout out to you congratulations you. mama Thank beyonce you. knows you 
Yes. For real. Yes. <laughs> Yes, love that. I absolutely loved that moment, y'all. It was, it was, it was just, uh, it was a moment of fandom. The people were living, we were dancing, we were singing, we were turned up. Like, it was absolutely that. I don't really have much else to say except for you need to go see the film. You need to go see the film. Um, it'll give you a new appreciation for the tour if you did go and see the tour. And if you did not, I think that you will absolutely get your life. Um, uh, and I, I think it would make you be like, Dang, I'm, I'm hurt that I missed this for whatever reason it may be. Um, but you can always go back and look at my top 10 favorite moments from the Renaissance. Uh, if you want to live those moments in real time, um, and you can also go see the film. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. An Oscar winner, Golden Globe, Emmy, like, uh, I don't know what, it could be eligible for definitely an Oscar for sure. Probably even a Grammy. Um, but yeah, no, this was stellar. I mean, the clips of her like from different cities and like, oh, seeing Blue and, and finding out that uh, she was only supposed to do one show. Right. But she ended up doing the whole thing after she killed it. And she realized like somebody was talking a little trash online and she wanted to prove them wrong. Come on, baby. My power. Like there were so many minutes, moments that I wanted to like cry. Um, it, it definitely lit a fire up under me to get it together, baby, to get it together and not even get it together because I've been working really hard. But like to work a little bit harder, baby, really get in there, really do what I need to do. Like I would love to be a creative director or like a, a, an, a, a tour manager or a tour assistant or However, like I would love that. I would love nothing more to to work with my favorite artists and like really bring their vision to life or help manage their vision or whatever I could do. You know what I mean? And this film really showed me. I mean, her love for Houston and where she came from and how she rose in that like and the people around her, you know, thanking the people around her. I just she did her thing. She absolutely did her thing. I also still don't know where that sound was coming from that I've been hearing all day, but it is what it is. Unique. But yeah, um, the Renaissance, Renaissance, a film by Beyonce, a film on gratitude, 10 out of 10, would recommend, will recommend, do recommend. I'd love to probably see it again. Um, and I recommend if you saw the tour, absolutely go see it, 100%. And if you did not, absolutely go see it like they did such a good job at making you feel like you were really in it and the thing about that tour is you really just from uh not being in it like <laughs> already experienced it you really get to take a moment to see like this tour was just a celebration it was fun it was so much fun Fun. And I can only imagine what it was like to tour that for that summer, this summer, and just live in that and, and, and experience that from their perspective. Just cheering on the the dancers, everybody that, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was just absolutely a moment. It was absolutely a moment. I could go on and on like I keep saying and I keep talking. Um, I'm, I, I'm hoping I'm not missing anything. I'm sure I am. Um, I'm sure others will detail this way more. Um, but this isn't necessarily supposed to be an analysis. Um, it was just my experience and um, just my gratitude and, and how much, again, it, it inspired me and it uplifted me and it made me say like, OK, Tommy, like keep going. Keep doing what you got to do. Keep keep putting your all into this work that you're doing um, and it will pay off. You just got to put the work in. You know what I mean? And one thing I thought that she said was beautiful before I go is she said as a performer, like uh, uh, the the way you become a great performer or a great artist is by living life. And that's something that I was taught in school at Chapman. My professors used to say that all the time. And I think I've realized taking a step back, like from my acting and things, is that I have become a better artist just because I've been living life. But yeah, just growth and, and age and wisdom comes better art. 
and she really has done that. And I, I don't think there's any stopping her. She does have a new song that came out, My House. That sound, it's a bop. It's cool. It's it's cool. It might be a grower, just like Break My Soul was a grower. Break My Soul, I did not like it. Yeah, I'm in the theater. Turn up, turn up, baby. Um, but yeah, I think that's it. I think that's it. I said being a, oh, being a black woman. That's something I want to say too. They were playing her. Oh, we don't have this. We don't have that. You can't do this. You can't do that. I googled it. It exists. Why are you playing with me? Stop playing with Beyonce. <laughs> Y'all think she's dumb? Y'all think she's dumb? Baby, Google exists. I. Baby, <laughs> she found it. She found it. Yeah. And I know whoever those people were that she was referring to and that were there because she didn't really show them. Um, I know you feel silly. And it's okay. It's okay. Just don't lie. It's okay. You got it. You got to do a little extra work, but you got it. You got to, you got to just do it. Don't lie to her. Um, being a mother, uh, I thought that was really interesting. Like her saying like she was always a mother, even in moments where she was literally just getting off stage, you could hear the babies calling for her. <laughs> like, baby, I'm literally performing for 70,000 people. And the baby's like, where's mommy? Where's mommy? Mommy? Like, baby. <laughs> They have no concept. They don't care. Like she said, they don't care about where your job is or who you are to everybody else. To them, your mommy. And that's your your first job and only job in their minds. <laughs> so I love that. I absolutely love that. Uncle Johnny, her voice, like I said, her celebrating her uh, 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 her greats, the people that she loved. Um, those were moments. Yeah. I wish I would have got featured on the, on, the, on the film. But, you know, it is what it is. The next one. Um, but I'm interested to see just where things go from here. How long have we been going? 15 minutes? Okay. All right. That that seems cool. That seems cool. So I'm glad we went to that. I'm glad we experienced it like that. It was dope. So anyway, y'all, uh, roadies, uh, the Doja video is coming out. Um, it's going to be on her last show date. So I'm going to say it's like the 13th or so of December, uh, but that's coming out. If you want to get a full breakdown of that, I'm really doing a deep dive. Y'all know the way that the beehive really rides for Beyonce is how I ride for Doja. So I'm giving like an in-depth look at how we got through the, the, the Scarlet era, how we got to the tour, all of that stuff. Then the tour, like it's just going to be jam packed. It's going to be a jam packed episode. So look, be on the lookout for that. Make sure to subscribe y'all. I think I only need like 12 more subscribers before I become monetized on this joint. So please, please, please do me a favor, subscribe so we can just have, it's going up, it's been going up and I was talking about it today, but just, you're going on another tangent, but just to see this film, uh, it, it really brings into perspective how much if you just keep going at something and working and especially when you make it on your own, when you do your own stuff. Right. Because with acting, I had to rely on other people. I had to keep auditioning and keep trying to prove myself to people. I won't go into that. (laughs) Okay, but here I don't have to prove myself to anybody. I can just be and live and and give my art and give my all um, into this and I get to control it and it's just up to y'all whether you receive it or not and so to see that 982 of you have been receiving it and more really when we look at other like numbers as far as views but like um, yeah it means a lot it absolutely means a lot and so it's like do it do it whatever it is you want to do do it and do it on your own like as much as you can do it on your own and by do it on your own I mean just make it happen obviously other people are going to help you like build what it is you're trying to build if you need help ask for it absolutely but start that thing do whatever that thing is like absolutely Beyonce thank you yeah yeah thank you for ending my year with this so I can go into a new year really ready Cause she said 40 is good. She said 40 is great. And so I'm going to finish up. You know, I, I played in my 20s. My 30s, 30s is go, go, go. So that 40s, baby, I want to be living like her. I, no, I'm going I'm to usher in that financial her. But even if it's not at that level, even just a pinch, baby, I'll take a, just a pinch of the money that Beyonce has, baby. I would be living my best life. So, yeah. Um... Such a great film. I don't want to ruin it. So I'm just say go view it. Go see it. Go experience it, y'all. And yeah, 
All right. I'm going to see y'all later. <laughs> All right, roadies. I'll catch you on the next one.